This is solutions video number two to talk about your solutions to, to writing the linear equation when given those two points. So let's take a look at some more hints to help you along. So what we want to remember is for questions one through eight, you already found the slope. You did that work yesterday. So we found the slope. Now we have to move on to step two. So step two is to take the equation and plug in what we know. We know the slope is one half. So I'm going to start my equation and write y equals one half x plus b. Okay, I have my equation. I'm still looking for b though. I want to find m and b. So now remember you plug in what you know and you know a point. You actually know two points. But we're just going to do the one point here and plug in what we know. So we're going to plug in 4 for x and negative 1 in for y. And we're going to figure out what b has to be to make this equation work. Okay, so everything else stays the same. The 1 half and the b all stay in there. And we're solving now for b. So we have negative 1 equals 1 half times 4 is 2 plus b. Solving for b, we get b equals negative 3. Okay, so we're done. We have our equation. We have everything we need for our equation. So I'm going to take this equation and I'm going to write 1 half x still, but now I know my b value from from what I solved in red is negative 3. So 1 half x minus 3. That's the equation for number 1. Let's take a look at number 2. I'll get you started, but I want you to try and finish on your own. So remember, we found the slope yesterday was 3. So now we're going to plug that into our equation, 3x plus b. The second thing we're going to plug in is the point that we know. I like to pick the one that has positive numbers because I think I'm faster with that. 7 equals 3 times 2 plus b. Now I'm going to solve. I'll let you try and solve it on your own and see if you can get the answer of y equals 3x plus 1. See if you can finish this equation and find that b equals 1. So definitely ask your teacher some questions. Those solutions will show up on the next page, but you should be checking your work as you go using the solutions that you'll see here. So here are the equations you should have come up with for 3 through 8. Ask questions if you got it wrong or if you notice an error that I made in writing the equations.